Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today I am doing like a first impression Get ready with me, just first impression, I don't know But I picked up a package today from Lethal and I ordered some of their new face products and also a red lipstick So I was planning on doing a video on that and oh my god I also have some shades from Lethal that I haven't used yet, that I ordered a while ago. It's a these shade, so like a pinkish, purple, blue, grey palette. And I want to use this today. And I also did order one of the pre-made face palettes. So I ordered one for light very fair to light skin, I think it was. It's Boreal. Boreal. With these three shades. Hello. With these three shades. So the highlighter is Flux. And I think that is only in this palette. The blush is Nectar. And the bronzer is Atlas. And yeah, and my <laughs> blush, it came with like, I think some air under there. I could press it together and I think it will work, I really hope. And I'm going to use at least the bronzer. I'm going to try to use it as a contour and the highlight. And then I actually bought a single blush as well. I bought the one in hybrid. It's a lavender blush and it is this one. So I actually think I'm going to use this blush today together with my purple eye look. And then the lipstick I ordered was in Riptide. Riptide. And it is the red one. I don't think though I will use this red today. I will use some kind of red to my lips. I don't think I will use this but some red. So okay. I am going to prime my eyes. And I think I'm going to do this like a get red with me. Um, yeah. I just. I, I have no idea what I want to talk about though. But <laughs> for some strange re reason. I always figure it out. Or I come somewhere. I don't know if I figure it out, but I get somewhere. And yeah. But I was f planning on not to have super long videos now during December, but it might doesn't go well. I don't know. So, okay, I actually don't know what I want to do with these shades that I have. These ones, I just like, okay, I haven't used this and I want to, so maybe I think I should start with this one in my crease and I don't know the name of these. If I, I'll see it's on the way in here. If I like have the patience to Write it down in the description, I will, but I will start with this light pinky shade and take it in my crease. And ooh, this looks nice. And I like try to not have Astrid in here. But This is what I get when I like close the door. She really wants to be here. And I think one of the reasons she really wants to be in here is because she not able to be, but maybe I should just open it up for her. Or do you fix it yourself? Okay, this pink, no, she haven't. I don't know if you can hear her. And there the door is open and she's in here. I don't mind to have her in here as long as she doesn't make too much sounds and like is all crazy. And 
I don't know. It might be like that when you see this video that we have two cats again. I don't know when this is coming up. I have really tried to plan things and I have just gone pretty good and now she is doing something. I really don't know what I want to take in my crease more. I want to deepen this down but I don't know how. I think I might try to go in with this bluish shade just to have something more in my crease. And the one thing why I don't want her here, okay, if you just stay, Astrid. And she really likes, want to be in the bed, and I am okay with that as long as she is still, because otherwise the camera will move. And if you're wondering what I'm talking about, um, we have a really small apartment, so I'm doing my makeup in our bedroom and you are standing on the bed. And I like love <laughs> to see people when they're doing like the makeup collection or like behind the scene when they're like showing their filming room and they're like, it's pretty small. And I'm like, you at least have a room. I do not. I so badly want to move. And we actually <laughs> checked out a house in the area that we want to live. And the house was... It was not good at all. I think it had been empty for like a while and... So, editing me here. One of the files was corrupt, but I, I don't have time or energy to do the get ready with me all over again. So I am just going to hop in here and said that was a file that was corrupt and I didn't talk about anything important as usual. And I will leave all the shades I've used down in the description if you want to see, but yeah, just to hop into the future me, I will have a lot more eyeshadow on when you see me again, just so you know. Okay, my camera shut me off. I have no idea why. And I have no idea when. Okay, and I'm actually thinking of doing my... My... What is it even called? My foundation and everything. off camera and then we do like the highlighter, the blush and the bronze contour together and we will see how that look and then we're going to try to maybe pick a lipstick together and we will see how I will fix this but I will. So I'm going to wait, wait, <laughs> to wait, wait, to take away the fallouts, put on my base and my brows and then I'll come back. So time to get some uh, movement to this face movement some something to this face and i feel so freaking dry i hate this when i don't have taking any setting spray yet so okay i will go in with this one and see if i can like contour with this am i a little bit scared yes i am i just dip it once and i have no idea how Pigmented? Okay, pretty pigmented. Okay, maybe this is a little bit too warm to like contour with. I'm so bad at like contouring and stuff. And okay, I think <laughs> yeah, this might be too warm, but you know what? We just have to live with it, I guess. It might don't look that off doesn't feel like it was so good on this. Maybe. Maybe it actually works like for contouring. I'm trying to see how it looks in the camera. 
but maybe it is like a better of bronzer shade because it is bronzer but I do not bronze because that's not who I am so maybe you ask yourself why did you buy this because I love lethal and okay I actually want to go in with the single blush that I bought in what was you called where are the package hybrid hybrid yes this one and I have no idea how pigmented this is I watched a net video I don't remember but okay just a little bit should I just start and I like don't know if I will how I will look in a lavender blush I have no idea okay I don't feel that this was as pigmented or I was a little bit more afraid as the bronze shade I, I'm not mad at it at all I like my base products to be a little bit more sheer because then you can build it up and I hate when you have like a blush and you take it and it's just like crazy much at the beginning so I like this it's easy to blend out at least and I actually like this shade I don't know how much you can see on camera can you even see this I am not sure but I can. I think that is so hard with like trying uh, base products because I'm not like one of these persons that have a lot of blush I say and I take a lot of blush now but I hope that you can see it and I I actually like this. So okay I'm going in with the highlighter so this one and when I opened this I was like this is really 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 pink isn't this going to be too dark for me but this is for light complexion so we'll see I have a highlighter from lethal from before ionic and I really liked it and okay I really like this one as well. I think though this highlighter was exclusive to this face palette. So I don't think you can buy it as a single. And okay. I like this one. I don't know. Yeah, you can see it I think. It is not too dark for me. I really do like it. I think the highlighter I have has a little bit of a rosy sheen. This is the one I have, Ionic. I think it has like a pink shift to it. But this is like pink pink. And I do really like it and I think this performs as the other one that I have so okay do you know what I really 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 want to do right now I want to spray my face I really do like this little palette and the Leven lavender <laughs> lavender blush maybe the this one isn't made for contour because I think it looks maybe a little bit too warm but it is a bronze shade, so it is me. But yeah. Okay, where do I put mine? So I'm going to do something for the under eyes. And I think I wanted to do kind of the same. So I think I'll just go in with this pink one and this bluish one. And might take this one just to deepen down my little crease. No, my outer corner. So I'll start with the pink one, just to, just because the other shades are darker. 
what's up with me? I am so tired today. Sometimes when I super tired, it's like my brain stops working and now my battery is almost out. So I think I will just do this lower lash and put on something in my waterline and a mascara. And then we can try to choose a lippy for this one. It has to be red. So yeah, I will do that and then I come back because I, this is not fun to watch me put shadow underneath my eye. So yeah, I see you in a little bit. So in my waterline, I took the M5 over from Colourpop. I love this one. And in my inner corner, I actually took in this one. And for my lips, I am going to take this red one that I bought together. I think you just have to just have to do it. I'm just watching some other reds, but I'm like, okay, I'm taking this. So this was Reptide, Riptide, Riptide from Lethal. So a little bit of overlined lips. It is okay. It hasn't killed anybody. So this is my finished get ready with me testing new things from Lethal and I can start with the lipstick. I love this red shade, says the person who has too many red lipsticks, but I really like this shade. Lethal is not my favorite when it comes to liquid lipstick. They are really, really good, but it's not my favorite. They can be a little bit drying for me, so I really need to have like my lips in good condition to wear them. But other than that, they are, they are good liquid lipstick. And I was, was dying to use a red. I don't know if I should talk about eyeshadows. I have tested a lot of eyeshadows from Lethal, but yeah. I use some of these. I can write down in description which one I have used. Sorry, future me. They worked really good. Have nothing against them at all. And okay. The face palette. I know that I used this bronzer shade as a contour. I think it might work. I don't know how much you can see because I am the light contour person. I have nothing against it. Is it my favorite? No. And also it is kind of pigmented, just so you know. I usually use one from Kaleidos that is really like sheer and I like buff it in. Uh, I can't do it with this because I'm going to have too much. I haven't tried this blush, uh, but the highlighter, I really liked it. I think it is really nice. It's pink but it's not like too pink and then the blush that I used this one that was called hybrid how can it be so hard like am I serious I have to check this up I'm like 98 yeah hybrid why yeah, just be a little bit more self-confident please I really like it. It's like my first blush that is this really like lavender and purpley. That's why I wanted to buy it because I don't have that in a blush and I like it. That I didn't feel, maybe I was a little bit more careful, but I didn't feel like it was that pigmented as the bronzer shade, but I like it. So I'm happy with these. I'm going to love this highlighter, I think. And you can take the shadows or you can take them out from this packaging. What's up with my speaking ability today? So I might take out this bronzer and maybe pop in the other uh, blush and uh, we will see. But I really do like this and I hope that you like this video. And as always, I'm so sorry for the messiness and like all over the place and my bad mood. But you are here. 
so you know what you're getting. It's not my fault. <laughs> but yeah, I really hope you liked this video. And if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do. So you don't miss any of my videos. And now, as I have said in so many of these videos, I am uploading each and every day now in December. And I would love it if you would be part for my... 31 days of red. So yeah, I really hope you liked this video and I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye!